Here are three ways in which you can use to open Vim. First method is via search bar, second method is by right-clicking on file to edit and choosing Vim, and thirdly via terminal. Vim is a text editor that comes pre-installed on most Linux distros. To use Vim for your editing, use the terminal to open it by typing VIM, and then pressing Enter key. When the window opens, press the letter I key, so as to start writing something on the editor. In this demo, I'll write a simple HTML file. To copy and paste on Vim, highlight the line you want to copy, and press the letter, Y. Now, to paste what you copied, go to the line or place you want to paste the copied data, and press the letter, P key. To delete we simply use the T key. To check current directory you're on before saving your data, simply press the escape key, and press the full colon key followed by the letters PWD, and press enter. This command will output the full path of your current directory. To change your current directory to something else, use the command colon plus cd, followed by the path to directory you want. cd is a short form for change directory. Combining the command with the path to change to, accomplishes the task. To save your edits, press the escape key, and type the command, w, followed by your file name. Don't forget to specify the file type if it is a new file. The W key instructs the editor to write the changes done to your destination file. To save your edits in a different directory, press the escape key, and then type colon followed by the letter W for write and finally specify the full path to where you intend to save the file. To save your edits and exit Vim, press the escape key, and type the command, W followed by Q. The W key instructs the editor to write the changes done, 
and QP instructs the editor to quit after the changes have been saved. If you opened a file with Vim, and only wanted to do changes and save current file changes as you continue editing, press the escape key and combine colon with W command, and then press enter as seen in this demo so as to write the changes.